Welcome back to Resident Evil 3. Let's go to the subway station. Hopefully we'll get there without any drivers. All right, so we did just pick up a key. I'm guessing it's to this one just here. Yeah. Oh, what are the odds that dude's going to get up? Hang on. The map says there's still stuff to pick up. So I'm just going to take a quick look around and then we'll go. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's not worrying. Oh my god, it's so dark. <laughs> Part of me still thinks that, oh, maybe turn up the brightness. But it's like, no, no, don't do that. We want it dark because we want it scary. Because who knows what's lurking at the darkness. Just all the nightmares. Anyways, we picked up everything, so let's just use the key. Oh, maybe I should put that stuff away. Hang on, there is a red herb just there. Hey. Okay, I had to check. Oh, that one got up though. Oh my god. Oh, oh, hey, you, I shot you in the face. That's cheating. I shot you in the face. I checked on purpose. You son of a... Oh, you're not. You done? God damn. Uh, I really don't like these things. They're just a giant pain in the ass. He banging though. Well. Go back and put some stuff away. There is just a storage chest just here. Was someone walking just there? Oh my god. I thought I heard footsteps. I mean, I know something awful is happening in there with that dude's daughter. You're okay, Jill. I know you're slightly wounded, but you've had worse. Probably. I mean, you've been in how many explosions in the past? Like, 30? No. Oh. Mm. I don't like you. I know that's probably like a waste, but I don't care. I really hate these things. They're just so irritating. It's like, open up, and then they don't open up, and then they do that shit. Ah. Uh. It's like, what is there to do? Okay, shotgun, maybe. I'm okay. I'm only cautioned. <sighs> Newspaper? Raccoon Times Reader's Column? Dear Editor, I'm writing, you, I'm writing to you because I'm troubled, deeply troubled. Anyone who's been a parent knows that Crystal Promenade is the place to take your kids for a trip downtown on Saturdays. And there's no, and there's no store more popular or harder on a parent's wallet than Toy Uncle. However, I've noticed that on windy days, the big statue above the entrance wobbles like the only thing holding it up is a couple of screws. If that statue's head tumbles loose on a busy day, children will be badly hurt. I've complained to the manager three times now, they just isn't willing to rectify the situation. 
Are we supposed to wait for a terrible accident to happen before taking action? No. If heads are going to roll, then let it be the managers. Take that death trap down. Timothy Wall, 69. Are you saying I need to destroy a statue? Why not? Nice, sir. You know what? Just uh, get the shotgun out. All right, came from there. This way. It's just so quiet. It sucks. Because you know, Nemesis is just gonna <laughs> fuck up your day. Like that. Oh, great. You have yet another new toy. What is it? You can probably guess. Oh my god. Time to run. Oh! Rocket launcher? Really? That seems excessive. Why do you want me dead so bad? I can probably guess because you're programmed. Ah! Ah! Holy shit, boss. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Oh, oh, I mean, I can obviously see the laser. Oh lordy, oh lordy. You know turn the volume up just a bit more. More. Jill, you okay? Carlos, that monster's on my ass again. Are you shitting me? I thought you killed it. Me too. Oh, oh. We, we gotta go, Jill. He's gonna keep shooting those rockets. Oh, there's the- okay. The toy thing. Gotcha. Oh, we need that. Hang on, just seeing if there's anything else to pick up. No. Yeah, we're, we're wobbling a little bit here, but we'll be okay. Probably. Like we have much, much of a choice here. Oh dear. We've actually come. We've oh we've come back here. That's pretty whack. I know I didn't pick up everything here. Not that I have much of a chance to these days. Oh whoops. Maybe don't stand in fire. Yeah, because you can see like the map is still kind of red. That was probably something just like back that way. Yeah, but you know it's all kind of on fire, so I'm happy to call it a loss. Yeah, we were actually back here. How about that? Oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> um. <laughs> um. <laughs> I thought I was the one that had to shoot that. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Whack. He's there. Oh shit. Ah. Open. Jill, this way. Hi. It's good to see you. Okay. 
Go. Go. God, you have a pretty face. Out of here. You can say that again. Uh. All right. Good, 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 good gerb. Good gerb, everybody. Damn, he's got a lot of toys. Carlos, I know we didn't get off to a great start, but thanks for the save. Hey, you saved my ass first. You're a hell of a lot braver than me. Why don't we compl matters, compliment each other more on the train? Yeah. Hey, you'll be safe. Mm hmm What about you? Not from the sound of it. I won't be catching the train. Why not? No, there'll be new orders. If it oh. means I can help save the city, it's fine by me. That's right. I never got the map of this area, didn't I? I guess it's okay. I wonder where it was. Seeing if I picked up everything. It looks like I did. Yeah, it's all nice and blue. <sighs> Good work. Your reputation is well deserved. Get inside. The subway's about to leave. Carlos, Tyrell, you have your orders. You need to go back out into the city and find Nathaniel Bart. This isn't the last ride out of town, right? Do not worry. Once the civilians are safe, the train will be back. It's all right. You're going ahead. But I'm not going to die on you and leave you in a cold, cruel, Carlosless world. Okay. You'll need to find this scientist. His vaccine research could save us all. You see? You're learning. The only life that matters is your own. Good luck. Let's go! September 29th to 11 a.m. You don't really think a pencil pusher like Barton is still alive, do you? I have it on good authority. Why? Are you worried about teammates? Or something else? Funny how brainless zombies can ambush a platoon like that. Funny the gate was locked. Don't you think? <laughs> What was that? How is this fucker not dead yet? Just no. They're gone. Come. This way. Nikolai, what are you doing? It's not after you. <laughs> Nikolai! Get off my train, shit bird! <laughs> September 29th, 2.34 a.m. Well, it's been a while. Subway's gotta be clear of the city by now. Along with your hot date? Nah, but she's not like that. Hell, she's not like anybody. <clears throat> oh, we're playing as Carlos. Right. Keep your head screwed on, Romeo. This is the police station. Are you sure? It looks like a cemetery to me. Mm -hmm. What do you have? All right, so you are packing heat, but you're not packing any Heelys, my man. I guess that's okay. Ugh. All 
Oh, I gotta walk that way. Okay. But that Nikolai dude. Does he even do anything? He just kind of sits there and... He's just an asshole. <laughs> like, like, what does he actually do? Obviously, he's sabotaged. Missions. Come on, man. Not you too. Sorry. Sorry. Locked. You stay on the door. I got this fucker. Hey, fucker. Come get some. Hate machine guns, to be honest. They're like the most inaccurate thing ever. And they're weak as fuck. It's open. They use so much ammo. Oh, you dropped something. An ID card. Okay. Oh, it's Brad! I didn't even- oh, okay. Brad Vickers. Is that the dude at the start of the game? I think? Yeah. Stars. That, could be useful. that was Jill's partner, wasn't it? Ben, that sucks. Where'd that cop go? Oh! Hey. Don't know, don't care. We got a job to do. If our intel's still worth a damn, then Bard's in the Star's office. Let's find him and take him into custody. Oh, so this is the same police station as Resident Evil 2. How about that? Oh, okay. That's Carlos, cool. take a look at this. I've located the star's office. Remember, Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. Hmm. Right. Good to know. I'll open the shutter so you can get through. You stay here and find out what's been going on here at the station. Call you if I find anything. Okay. Hey! Be careful. Yeah. You too, man. What's in your storage chest? Not much. I guess I better keep the ID card on me. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Yes, yeah, is the same as Resident Evil 2. Same place. Keep out. Yeah, All okay. Right. You want me to keep out? I'll keep out. <laughs> Probably for a good reason. I just want to explore a little bit, you know? Oh man, this makes you want to play Resident Evil 2 again. Back then, oh, I played it on like a potato of a computer. So the quality is really Very bad for me. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I should play it again, for sure. I just want to see if there's anything up here, because it's red. Yo. Yeah. Anything else? That should be it. Okay. Go down the stairs. Yeah, that's cool. God damn, Resident Evil 2 was great. Just seeing what I picked up. <sighs> oh, what is this? Uh, ID? Okay. Ah, oh, it's just ammo, right. Thank you. ID card security protocols, September 16th, 1998. Each member of the force has been issued an ID card. From now on, the same card will be required to access all storage boxes. Do not lend your card to anyone. Take great care in using it. If your card goes missing, report it, report it lost immediately. RPD Facility Maintenance Department. Alright. Nice, nice. Oh god, what enemies are you going to encounter? <laughs> Oh shit. What the hell was that thing? <laughs> that is that a liquor? It might have been a liquor. Oh my god. Oh shit. 
couldn't have been a zombie. Oh my god. Just stop. Just. Oh, you, you can't knife him. Really? I just wanted to make sure he was actually dead, dead. That's all. You gotta check these things. Oh my god. Oh, that's right. They had like those special doors with the different symbols. And you have to get the keys. Oh! Takes me back. This, however, didn't stick around. is not cool. Oh no. Oh god. <laughs> this... Here we go. This is <laughs> very creepy. Oh shit! Oh no! <laughs> oh! Fuck me sideways. God. I'm just gonna check something like super, super quick. I just wanna make sure the audio is okay. Yeah, it's okay. I just turned up, um, what do you call it? The voice volume. Just so like you can hear them. Oh, talking is all? Well, that's that's good. I thought it was a bit quiet before. So I just wanted to fix it. I know nothing stays dead in this, but one can only hope. Oh. I'm just taking this nice and slow, okay? You copy? There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Something nasty? All right. I'll take a look with the cameras. Watch your six. Cheers. Just seeing how much ammo I have. I have more machine gun ammo, so I better use it. What's in here? I got an operations room. Hang on, go back. Is that this one, the operations? No, hang on, go back. Uh, I missed something. Oh. Locker room cap. <laughs> Is that I missed something? Go back for a second. I'm like super freaked out. The music and the atmosphere. How's it so much worse? How is it so much worse? Oh, 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 hi. Hi, you go back up, huh? Hmm. I just saw that on the map that I didn't pick up something. There it is, though. On the table. Uh, oh, take it. A flash grenade. Okay. Sure. Flash your enemies. I'll distract them. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, ignore me. Oh my god. Oh, I can't open that. Okay, I guess I have to go this way. Oh my god, this sucks. Open it. Don't open it. Don't open it. Don't open it. Don't do that. Never open it. Don't open it. Uh. I'm fine. Literally. Shit balls. Oh my god. Who's making that? Oh shit, 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 shit. I thought you could you probably dodge too, right? Oh god. Oh my god. Fuck. This is so bad. Uh I'm almost dead already. Uh Shit. I don't even have a... Ugh. I don't have a red herb. I mean, I can just use the green one. I know that. But, um, it would be better if I just found something to mix it with. But I'm dead next hit, though. Ugh. 
Actually, I'm gonna use up all my ammo for this. I should probably just heal. Oh, you came from that way. Oh, let's just do it. I kind of need it. Shit. Locked. Oh, jeez, I chewed through so much ammo doing that. This is so much scarier than everything else. A scope for the assault rifle. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Why you didn't, like, start with that is... I just don't know why. <sighs> September 20th arrest report. Name Rodney Gray, unemployed, former electrician. Charges, unlawful creation and or possession of explosives. Subject was seen behaving suspiciously at 1442 Box Street on September 18th, September 18th, 1998. Suspect's person was searched, producing a small explosive and a timed detonator from his inside pocket, leading to arrest on the charges listed above. A search of suspect's home found more than 20 additional homemade explosives at various stages of completion. Suspect was extremely agitated and not sound of mind. Suspect spoke feverishly when questioning began, and at one point questioning had to be halted due to a sudden bout of shrieking from suspect. One questioning was resumed, once questioning was resumed, sorry. Suspect made the following statements. I didn't do it for me. I did it for you. Why doesn't anyone understand the corpses attack from the shadows? A storm's coming, but this umbrella is no good. Gotta blow it up or you'll be more than just wet. You'll be- what? You'll be more than just wet? Oh, okay. Gotta get more bombs. They're coming. Soon. Gotta hurry. Burn them. Burn the corpses. Burn them good. During questioning, the suspect began to shake violently before resuming a shrieking fit. Questioning was ended, and a sedative was administered. Due to the suspect's unstable psychiatric condition, suspect's testimony changed from a moment to from moment to moment. Suspect's delirium made any sort of dialogue impossible. We are currently awaiting the results of a doctor's investigation into suspect's condition. The explosives collected from the suspect's person and residents appear to be extremely powerful. As a safety precaution, a battery was removed from one detonation device upon its admission into evidence. The battery was secured in the safety deposit room. All right, that's a lot of info. That's cool. How much of that was useful? Oh shit, there's the, damn it. There's that herb. That red herb that I really wanted. Now I gotta find a green one. It's useless by itself. Uh-oh. Uh. I don't recall seeing a code. Maybe I'll just stumble across it at some point. Wanna open that? Uh, is this a dead end? Uh, yes it is. A code, a code. I swear to God, don't get up, zombies. I'm legitimately spooked. Consider me very spooked. I kind of fucked up shooting cops. They're not cops anymore. There's zombies, my man. 100% zombies. Why oh, the spooky music? Don't do that to me. Jesus. <laughs> Why did it play such scary music? Don't do that to me. Come on. Oh, God damn it! I've got a bunch of red herbs and no green herb to go with them. Eternal Memo. September 22nd, 1998. Oh, shit, the code's just there. Office Supply Internal uh, Relocation Notice. Heat Resistance 3 Number Combination Safe moved from STARS Office 2F to West Office 1F. 
The combo is left 9, right 15, left 7. Please change the combo ASAP upon receipt. Okay, RPG facility maintenance department. So 9, 15, 7. Hang on, I'll look at that again. There's like, there's just a save here. Uh, oh, that's much nicer. Well, if cameras killed those things, I'd be set. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, but I wish I had a green herb. Uh, at least put that one away. All right. Uh, save it. Okay. Um, code. Um, oh, the note isn't there. How? Oh, just want to look at the notes. This one. So nine fifteen seven. Okay. We're back. Yeah, this one. I'm gonna walk around. I'm just scared that corpse is gonna come to life. That's a legitimate fear, right? All right. Uh. Nine. Fifteen. Okay, so you also need hip patches. That's nice. I'm still gonna just walk around that corpse. All right, looks like I picked up everything in here. Oh, it's spooky. Really, really spooky. So everything is just tight, right? It's all like hallways and small rooms, you know? If I had a shotgun, I'd feel way better. I'd also feel better if I had a herb, like a green one. Carlos, the star's office is up ahead. Copy that. I guess he's watching us. Ah, oh, yeah, okay. Shower room. It looks like it keeps going up, though. Uh... Anybody home? Note to a friend. Hector, if you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you hear any noises coming from the locker, do not open it, please. While you are out on patrol, I focus on finding a way to get, the, get to the other side. I realize that explosives might be our best bet. I managed to rig up a pretty good bomb, but we don't have any batteries for the detonator. I'm pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room. Oh, pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room during intake last week. We need that battery if we're going to knock this wall down. So I headed upstairs to find you since I know you have the dis Oh my god. Since I know you have the safety deposit room key. As soon as I left the shower room, I was attacked. One of them bit me. I washed the wound as best I could, but I feel worse and worse. I hope I don't need to spell out why you must not open the locker. Please don't walk. Please don't worry about me. Just get yourself out. Just get yourself out of here as fast as you can. Your buddy Wes. P.S. Don't worry about that $600 I lent you. Think of it as a gift towards your upcoming move. Good luck, buddy. Wow, I like can't read. Break the shower room wall. Oh, thank God. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Perfect. Oh, you told me not to open it, right? But this one has a thing on it. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I saw a cap. There's a cap. Oh, what was this one? That's nice. Should I perhaps not open that? I, mean, I kind of want to, if I'm going to be honest. So that's where I need to put the uh, explosives, electronic okay. gadget. Guess we'll be doing this the explodey way. <laughs> All right. I can just put it on that. Maybe leave it there because it's going to take up an inventory slot. I got to find the battery. I'm wondering if I should actually open the locker. <laughs> Part of me is like, mm, do it. I know someone's going to be inside. All right. Oh, for fuck's sake! 
Why is it blocked? Well, what do you think? <laughs> There's like zombies everywhere. Come on, dude. Oh, God. Just uh, back up. <laughs> I got some hits on you. Uh. God, it's so hard to aim with a freaking controller. You staying there? For now? It'll be super inconvenient if you got back up anytime soon. The key. Uh, oh, oh, there's a dude just there. Make sure he's... He stays there. He's not gonna stay there. He's not. He won't. I know what this game is like. Uh... Oh. I'm guessing this is not... It's like someone's walking around. I'm guessing this is not going to be the same as the other one. Try to remember, like, oh, there were codes in the original game. I know one of them was, I think it was, like, that? Oh my god, is that actually... <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was the same in Resident Evil 2. That's... That was, like, literally the only code I remember from that. Oh my god. Holy shit. My memory. Oh, ho ho. Fuck yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't believe that worked! <laughs> I'm amazing. I amaze myself. Alright, well, I got a key, so I probably have to go back down. Oh my god, I can't believe I got that. <laughs> Yay. Alright, um... Save, since we did some great things just then. Alright, yeah, I think keep going. Might as well. I'm just anticipating... Uh... A liquor coming to get me. A well-worn key. Oh, maybe the safety to... <sighs> Deposit room. Oh, I don't want to get licked. Oh, there you are, dick face. <laughs> dick face? Uh, uh, no, it's alright, we just say. We're good. That doesn't do it for you, huh? Let's uh, take out a flashy grenade. Does that work on you? You're, you're, you are technically blind. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm- I'm very close to death. Also, did you call him Dickface? I thought that was pretty funny. No! Fucking- God. Just fucking try and kill it, at least. I don't know if I can kill it. Oh, okay. <sighs> well, I'm almost dead. I'm in danger. Oh. I'm not gonna save, but just... <sighs> oh my god, I only have... <laughs> I only have the red herb. Yeah, it's okay. Don't save. Um, I'll just reload a save and, you know, try not to take so much damage next time and, you know, if I die, it's okay. Just part of it. <sighs> I think liquors are probably, like, one of the worst enemies for me. Oh, <laughs> I already know what it is. <laughs> I did it. Fuck. Oh god, that's right. Oh, yeah. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. I live. Another day, at least. Oh. oh, that looks like I can put the ID card in, but I guess I can't. Okay. Oh, let's see. 109. 
I assume all of these are just going to be open. Ah, oh, there's the battery. Fuck yeah. Why does that need to be in storage? Oh, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Just a, just a game. Okay. What else do we have? Um, I'm guessing I... Oh, I don't want you getting up. Just stay there. The only ones that are here are 203 or 208. I got everything in the room though. Yeah, just check it. Yeah. Oh, there's no two, so you can't do them anyways. Alright, so I guess that's it. Um, look at your shit. Ah. Good. <sighs> Alright. Just thinking, like, do I want to take my grenade out, or should I just keep using the flash? Maybe just use the flash from now on. I know as soon as I go out this door, something awful is going to happen. I can feel it. Come out. Do it. There's always more than one. Ah. Uh. Okay, that's alright, that's just, that's just, whatever. You're okay. You still scared the fucking shit out of me, though. <sighs> okay, uh... Oh my god, I was like, why couldn't I save? It's all good. Um, you know what, storage is fine. Just do another save. <laughs> I, I'm like, just freaking out. <laughs> I'm freaking out here. Um, I'm okay. Uh, I'm good. Uh. Oh god, don't auto save. Don't do that. Copy that. Okay. I'm gonna have to run for my life. Probably. Okay. Three minutes. Time to run. Move. Um, I would... That was not three minutes, but that's way too close, guy. Jesus. Alright. Oh, hello. Um, hi. Oh, what the fuck, seriously? Oh shit, should I reload it? Quickly! One at a time, take a number! This is not ideal. Holy shit balls. Well, it's a good thing I had that. This asshole again. Oh my god! <laughs> Uh, all right. Um, a grenade would be. S you know what? Take that out for a second. Um. No! God fucking shit. Whoa! Run for it. Hang on. Okay, this is a perfect opportunity. Quickly equip this one. Throw it now. He's on the roof. Of course, he's on the fucking roof. Are you actually dead? Oh, I was hoping I could get all of you with the grenade, but I am very mistaken. Look at the map for a second. Um, shit. Rest head spray. That's, oh, okay. There's just way too many. Damn it, I was really hoping that grenade could save me. Uh, just look around super fast. Yeah, that's a shame. Because I was like, oh, I'll get the liquor, but also get all the zombies. 
Da sagt er, nee. Fucker. Hey, look, it's your twin. Oh, I've had caution already. I feel like Jill is a bit stronger than you, my man. You can take way more hits. She's like explosive resistant or something. I didn't even pick up the ammo. I'll have to go back and get the ammo. Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. Do you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. No, negative. RPD's overrun too. Then figure it out! Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send... Send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. I like him already. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you would. <laughs> you heard what he said. We can't turn him over to the company. Well, that's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. I'm gonna check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. All right. Uh, already. Take some time. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. Yep. Can you just stay there for a second? Oh shit! Don't trigger something right yeah, what's now. Up? I wanted to pick up the stuff I missed. Derailed. Was anyone hurt? Wait. Ah <laughs> oh, shit. What? Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, come in! T, I gotta go. Do what you gotta. I'll take care of Bard. Oh. Maybe that's the end of his... section? Oh yeah, we're back to Jill. I didn't pick up everything, I guess. I hope that's okay that I didn't pick up everything. It might carry over if we play as Carlos again, but... Can't do anything about it now. I didn't know it would end like that. It's okay. Oh boy. All right, back to Jill. Find a way above ground. But unfortunately, before we find a way above ground, we're going to have to stop it here for now because it is unfortunately break time. Okay, that's cool that we get to stop between Jill and Carlos. I like that quite a bit. Anyways. Thank you guys so much for watching. That whole section with Carlos, by the way, going back to the police station. Fuck, that was... Yeah, reminds me of, obviously, Resident Evil 2 and being back there. Super nostalgic and, oh my god, that was just fucking creepy. Liquors, like, absolutely creeped me out. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Please consider subscribing to the channel and liking the video. I really appreciate the support. I'm on a few different social media platforms. The links are in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.